Let's say just spread out. Hey, good morning, you guys. Happy Saturday. And today I'm going to show you all what this cornflakes really is. My feedback on it. I have been eating this for the past weeks, but good news though, I have never eaten this with milk. So this will be my reaction to eating it with milk as well. So you guys would have seen that the honeycomb, like first time I heard about this brand is when I went to Westby's to make our monthly grocery haul. For those new to the channel or just watching this product review, it will be linked at the end of this video. And for the returning subscribers, thanks again for joining us for another vlog. But you guys, like I have never heard about this brand before. We normally shop at Westby's and there was sale on this 20 TT dollars for this big box of cornflakes you all. And I was like, Try something new and it budget friendly. So we picked it up. Honeycombs, big real flavor, honey flavor as well, right? And it's the shape <laughs> of the honeycomb. And you guys, I have been eating this for the past week just like this. No lie. I've been giving Noraya this for breakfast and dinner as well. Sometimes as a snack. I normally place about 10, 12 in the bowl and Give her and she enjoys this. Nishidi was actually the one to open the box and she ate it. She said that she finds it a little big, so you have to eat plenty to get full. But for me, I just snack on it, so it was never really a thing for me knowing that a hey, is big cornflakes. Like there are some that are small, and then there are some that are actually big, as you guys can see, right? If Naraya sees me eating this right now, she will target it. But one of the things I did when I came home after purchasing this product is I went online to see reviews on it. And I was shocked to find out that this is actually a big cereal in the States, y'all. And you all know much for this on Amazon. Around 10 to 12 US for this, y'all. So I was like, wait. We get on this for $20, 30 Which is like three four dollars us and i was like what and why so i did some more research now and i found out that it was actually close to the expiry date which is june the 22nd so my thoughts is okay i could understand now that probably it's at half price because of being close to the expiry date but does that take away from the experience to me no and this is a good snack whether you get it close to expiry or a fresh box that is expiring in the next three four months i could just speak on this is my experience right something near to expiry date and we enjoying it still and you guys know about expiry dates and best before right something could have a best before date but it really will be good for the next 30 days and then best before 90 days so if you do some research on it you could see how they recommend the use but can they really sell it and at what price they could sell it determines how the grocery was able to do these little discounts and those type of things when they do a research on how they deal with products in the states and also in, um, in trinidad because in trinidad that really matter like they have to do it by a certain date and sell out and something they get a two for one special but as i said this is actually the first time i'm seeing this product Sorry if it's someone else got rambling, but my honest to God feedback and you'll actually see why I'm talking at eating this, right? So let me pour some milk and try this with the milk now, y'all. Because I really. And this milk has no sugar in it. And it's just both for eating frosted flakes and adding sugar to it. So for the past year, I've been eating cereal with no milk. So. The color actually changed with the milk, so that is actually cool. The color changed. And let me taste it now with the milk. This actually. Wow. 
this is actually nice y'all and to believe that i have literally been eating this without milk but just as a snack but this with the milk y'all wow it's really nice and the package was almost done so i'll show you all how much i literally eat and naraya as well <laughs> but wow if this was 40 dollars 45 dollars i'd have still pick it up just because i know the taste of it y'all and like this is my honest word reaction here tasting it with milk for the first time it was just a little snack all the time but this is our breakfast this is our dinner what yeah like wow so i do recommend it and as i said my honest word feedback and this is the circumstance on why we were able to get it for only 20 dollars and we have a next box of conflicts as well to review but we haven't opened that box as yet something else that we purchased for 20 dollars tt but you guys thanks for your love and support and we we'll see you soon in an upcoming vlog don't know when but soon bye don't forget to subscribe like share and comment below as well Mango to carry. <laughs> Reem really tell you about the soil. So if I did not watch Stephanie's vlog, I would have never known that this is passion food. So I just walked by and I was like, hey, I know what that is, Stephanie teach me. Finally, have you ever heard of this one? It's the opposite of Oreo.